It's a monthly wrap, and tonight I'm joined with Marcus Washington. How are you today, buddy? Fantastic, mate. There was a bit of a delay there. Uh, I don't know if it all happened on your end, but um, I'm here now. <laughs> no, that's all right. no worries, mate. It, uh, hey, look, it could be the uh, packing them up the internet. It's pouring down the rain, and uh, the internet doesn't like uh, the wet, wet weather up here. So yeah, we'll when, see that, how we when that that one gets wet, hey, it um, doesn't work anymore. By the sounds it's, actually, it's actually satellite, mate. It gets blocked by the raindrops, I reckon. So, but uh, no, what a what a, what a fantastic month! And uh, look, obviously during the week we uh, we had a, a great conversation with Nudge from Shanikas, and we had a bit of a competition, Marcus. Uh, we sure did. Uh, we had uh, put your best dad joke in the comments and uh, we had a beautiful hamper from Shanikas. And, uh, geez, there's some, some great jokes there. I think i um, going to write a few of those ones down. Uh, yeah, but, um, it. yeah, it was um, actually quite funny. And, and thanks so much for everyone joining in and um, as well joining in on the uh, the, the call with Nudge because, uh, yeah, obviously supporting local and giving them back as much as possible and get some exposure. And, uh, yeah. yeah, we can we'll probably announce the winner soon, I'm guessing, Tano. Yeah, mate. So look, we did. Have, we went through them all, and look, we went with the one that uh, had the most laughs on it. And I, I must admit, the one that I laughed the most at as well. So, congratulations to Carly Robinson as well. Uh, my sister said I could I yeah. couldn't make a bike out of spaghetti. Uh, you should have seen her face when I rode past her. I thought that was an absolute pearl of that one. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dude, that, yeah. No, there were some funny ones in there. I couldn't believe it. I was actually, um, yeah. I thought they were genuine jokes. So, yeah. um, <laughs> <laughs> but uh, look, I just um, again, thank you so much for everyone that supported. Uh, get down to, to the Shannon because it looks when we say that, support all the businesses down here, they're in Packham as well, but especially guys down at Shannon because um, they're doing the Father's Day pack. So, um, so Carly, yes, you'll be uh, getting a pack. So, Marcus, I know you've got the Carly's details. So, just getting get in touch with Carly. We'll organise that pack to go out. Uh, it'll either come out on Saturday or on Sunday morning. So you can get out there and check it out. But check out those Father's Day packs. We also got a, um, a pack today from Circa in Berwick, which is part of the Shandikas uh, franchise as well. They do a, an awesome little um, tapper's plate with some cocktails and things like that. Get onto that. We, uh, Mary and I are going to tuck into those straight after this. So, um, yeah, it would be good. So, yeah, again, let's just support local business and uh, and get around them. And, uh, look, we're going to be in lockdown for a long time, Marcus, I think. So we've got to, we've got to really support everyone we can. Yeah, 100%. Get around the local business. Just just think of them doing it tough. Yeah, that's it. So and um, next one, I suppose, Marcus, the, the real estate market. How are we, how are we going? Uh, yeah, fantastic. Um, I'll put a post up today just about that, uh, you know, we're, we're super lucky at the moment. Uh, things are still selling and people are still buying and we, we've had pretty much a record month this month um, over Zoom. Um, again, it's, it's um, you know, I just got the phone from a buyer earlier and, uh, you know, they're, they're contemplating putting an offering without seeing it and uh, just running them through all the scenarios and everything we need to talk about. And, yeah, people are open to it. People want to people buy. So, and you're going to run through the stats in a minute. Uh, but ultimately, yep. things are fantastic, really. Yeah, that's it. And that's it. So 45 properties under contract this month, $30 million worth of property sold, 39 properties listed via Zoom. So just absolutely massive numbers, 45 properties under contract uh, and $30 million worth of property. So that's about average sale price of about $670,000. Um, that's a huge, huge effort from our team. So um, just because my internet's a bit slow tonight, I'm not going to share the screen and show any of the properties, but we'll try and do that again. But I just don't want to freeze up and lose, use too much internet up here. But um, absolutely phenomenal results. Um, we, we sold properties from, you know, over 1.3 million, um, you know, right down to, to units and blocks of land as well. So absolutely fabulous effort from the team and uh, I could not be prouder. Yeah, everyone did an amazing job and, Again, we've been through this six times, so we kind of got used to it. Um, and yeah. I think that's the thing. Everyone's adjusted. I know it's not the ba the best thing, you know, when we talk about COVID, but everyone's adjusted. Everyone's changed their way to, to adapt. Um, and yeah. a lot of businesses have done that. And, uh, yeah. you know, if you want to survive, you've got to adapt. And that's, that's what we've done for the last uh, 12 months, you know, whatever, how many 200 plus days in lockdown we've been, we've adjusted to the, the, the climate. And uh, yeah. this time round... Uh, this lockdown has been the busiest we've ever been um, in lockdown as well as out of lockdown. So yeah, yeah. that's coming about, you know, the area that we're selling in and the people wanting to come to Pakenham, bigger blocks, more space, or Pakenham and Surrounds, I should say, um, you know, uh, bigger blocks, bigger space, newer hot properties, 
Um, the infrastructure's there, the amenities, everything is here in, in our southeast suburbs. So, um, again, it's an opportunity, and yeah. uh, I think the, a lot of buyers are jumping on it right now. Uh, so, yeah, it's I think it gives, uh, gives everyone confidence to, to buy into the area. Um, and, you know, for sellers, it, it is an absolutely fantastic time to put your house on the market. There are a lot of sellers that are holding off putting their house on the market. And we're coming into what would normally be our busy time of year with, with spring. Um, but the market isn't flooded with the amount of properties. Uh, a lot of people are holding off until we come out of lockdown. We don't know when that's going to be. So rather than just waiting and waiting and waiting, we've got to we've got to really jump on the opportunity now while the market is strong. We don't know what's going to happen when we come out of lockdown and when that time frame is going to be. But look, we've got to really work with it. And look, all of our properties that have been selling uh, have all been selling at the top end of the range or above. So the the competition out there is phenomenal. And I'm, you know, talking about listings that have just come online. 16 Gold Quest Way is one that just went live today, this afternoon. Uh, I've had 32 email inquiries on the property already. There you go. Like, it's incredible. So we've got the Zoom Zoom video there tomorrow, so we'll, we'll give everyone a good look at that. But, um, you know, price between 490 and 530 that's great buying in the area. So I can see why there's so much interest on it. But across the board, I mean, you had one up at Skyline Drive, Marcus, as well, that, um, you know, that went very quickly. Yeah, we had a lot of interest on it as well. It was, um, yeah, quite impressive. But it, it's just been across the board, really, um, that, uh, you know, there's limited properties. And, again, if your house is clean, presented, well, we've, we've probably got someone in, we've got someone that would probably buy it. Um, yeah. So, and, again, it's just the time where people are wanting to make the move and uh, change. It's, it's exciting. Yeah. I mean, I've, you know, we've all, myself and you've been in real estate quite a long time, and it's, it's great to see people changing their lives. It actually makes me feel like I'm doing something for them and helping them move on to an awesome change. And most people are doing that. But people yeah. sell a house by like caravan and they're going to work from the caravan two days a week and travel Australia. I've had people yeah. move to Queensland, stuck in quarantine. Had other people in Queensland, wherever, you know, WA. I've had people move to WA. Um, yeah. Not a lot of people staying in Victoria, but... Um, <laughs> <laughs> Um, but you know what I mean. It's um, it's exciting to see people changing up their lives, and I, I really yep. enjoy that. Um, and that's probably yeah, why I love my job so much. Yeah, so. look, in saying that, you know, I had a property at Osborne Grove, uh, the you know uh, first home buyer, absolutely so excited to to you know to get her first home. It was just um, absolutely fantastic to hear the you know just uh, her excitement in her voice, knowing that she'd secure the property when it went unconditional. Absolutely awesome. Um, and then, you know, the, the family from Osborne Grove bought a property from us off market in Lee Drive. Um, their excitement and the fact that they can go to that next stage family home, it, it's, it's what we love to do. It's, it's so much fun helping out families moving forward. And um, look, there's, there's a lot of work involved in the back end of what our team does. And I do want to do a big shout out to our admin team and our rental team, what they're doing behind the scenes. Uh, it's absolutely phenomenal. Um, the work that they're putting at the moment, working from home, homeschooling kids, uh, it's it's a challenge. There's no doubt about that. But um, you know, everyone's just doing such an amazing job, and we're so fortunate to have the people we do working behind the scenes for us. Because um, that's the great thing about Harcourt's backing them is that we are a team, and we all we all help each other out. That's it, and I think it's um, just uh, you know, it, it, it's actually uh, probably probably everyone thinks it's a lot easier to sell houses over Zoom and do that, but it's actually ten times. Well, I'd play say at least two, two times as harder. And, um, you know, I mean, every single buyer, we, we, we speak to pretty much every single buyer that is interested. Um, mm. You know, if you had 20 people on a Zoom, normally you'd have 20 people go through the open home. Um, those 20 people, no doubt, are going to probably contact you for questions. And that's probably the thing we have to convey to people is really a lot more information, which we're ha we obviously happy and love to do. But it is definitely two times the amount of work. Um, involved yeah. and um, I guess it's it's definitely no holiday at the moment for us so <laughs> um, it's definitely uh, working hard still from home and uh, making the most of it but um, yeah it's exciting definitely exciting yeah. so. no look we are we are we are you know definitely um, you know we're very fortunate in an industry and, a, and we work within a team in an area where people are you know moving forward and buying property but look it is great. Um, again, now on the seventh uh, this week, we've got Chris Holder. is a great person to listen to to have a uh, have a chat. So make sure you, you you check in there. Turn on the notifications to watch that. Chris Holder is is definitely someone's worth listening to. It gives you a great uh, mindset to to take on challenges. Um, I know personally, it's helped me a lot through 
uh, real estate career and uh, and just life really. So definitely um, definitely jump on board, listen to that. But again, local businesses, get in contact with us if you need, um, you know, just a bit of support. Um, you, you know, you might have a promotion or something like that you want to run, get, get in contact with us, we're more than happy to help. So, uh, and on the other side of it, in the real estate term of things, if you're looking to sell your home, please get in contact. If you're thinking, how are these guys selling properties sight unseen, give us a call. We'll put you in contact with our with our local expert within your area, um, and and make sure that we we're helping you out through that process. So, um, you know, it's we've we've got the formula and it works fantastically well, and we're getting great results. So um, we can get your property sold. It's 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 amazing time to be selling property. Well said, Tano. Love it. Legends. All right. Well, let's have a uh, got good night. We're uh, we're going to crack into some cocktails. So we'll uh, we'll see you on uh, we'll see you on Saturday night wrap tomorrow, mate. We will. We'll be back tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> See you, mate. See you, mate.